Hi, welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Aries. Welcome back, my loves. What's up, my loves? How are you doing? All right, I hope all is well, Aries. I hope you're taking care of yourself. All right, the readings here today may resonate for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, and South Node. All right, today we're going to start with your higher self, Aries. We're going to see what messages spirit, your angels, and your ancestors have for you. All right, and definitely stick around, Aries. We're going to pull the Love Romance Angel Oracle deck here for you to see what's coming towards you in regards to love, okay? And also, if you're new here, guys, definitely hit the notification bell, of course, right? So that way you're notified when I do post your readings. I do post your readings every three days, okay? So that way we can see where the energies have progressed and what we need to work on, evolve with, all right? That's the whole point, meaning for this channel, okay? Is we love and we evolve, okay? So definitely, if that's you, all right? Definitely hit that like button, show spirits some love, subscribe if you're new here, all right? And you will see for yourself, okay? We all about actions over here. All right. I know you know all about that, Aries, okay? You a whole fire sign, okay? We take action over here. I am a fellow Saggy, okay? So I understand, okay? We got to take action, Aries, okay? All right, so let's move forward, all right? So let's tap into your higher self. Let's see what messages your ancestors, Aries, your guides, your spirit guides, your angels here what they have to say for your soul lesson journey here let's see what needs to be worked on here within the next three days and then again we're going to pull the tarot decks out to get further clarification in regards to you and your person and just who's thinking about you all right so before we do that all praise is due to the most high okay so let's tap in with our higher self first that's very important and then we go into our love life over here okay Wow, we have two cards want to come out here. Wow, we have guilt. All right, so there is an energy here that is feeling guilty, okay? Let's see here. It says, I release any beliefs that no longer assist in my soul's growth, Aries, okay? So understand that, all right? So this could be either your energy or the person or energies that are around you and they're feeling this way in regards to guilt, or feeling guilty, all right? And it's okay. We've all been there, okay? Been there, done that, got the t-shirt, all right? But this is a situation here where there's a particular energy that is surrounding you, or Aries, this is you. Again, if so, it's okay, all right? Recognize why you're feeling this way, Aries. Recognize what is causing this situation to go this way, to even allow you to feel this way, Aries, for the one that it's hitting for you, all right, and not your person or your person and not you, at least as well, get an understanding of it because you always want to place yourself in your partner's shoes or in the situation overall, no matter who it is, partner, family member, friend, co-worker, whoever, all right, make sure that you are spiritually aware, okay, so we have guilt, okay, so there's an energy around you or within yourself that is feeling guilty due to a situation here that transpired for you, and then lastly, we have I love myself and I see myself in everyone, okay? That's the pride card, okay? So know that, yes, don't give up on yourself. If this is a situation here where you're feeling like because what has transpired between you and a certain individual here, Aries, don't give up on yourself, okay? Again, recognize it. Don't recognize it as a mistake or feeling guilty. Recognize it for what it is so it can help you evolve and become a better version of yourself, okay? Wow, beautiful. So let's see here. Let's now shift the energies here. Those are messages for your higher self, Aries, in regards to what's going to occur here within the next three days. Now, this could be mentally, physically, or emotional for you. You can feel mentally or emotionally in the energy of guilt, okay, due to what has transpired between you and someone else or cross watchers. This is you or your energy here, okay? However, just take it for who it resonates for. We all know our size shoes over here, okay? We're all grown. And if it don't fit, 
Just sit back and enjoy the vibes, okay? Spirit. What do we have for Aries? We're not going to shift the energies, okay? Those are messages from your angels and your higher self. So make sure to continue to love yourself, Aries. Have pride in yourself. Know that this is not it. Know that that relationship, that situation was there to teach you lessons so you can become a better version, version of yourself for your next relationship, all right? For your next experience, whatever that is for you, all right? So no need to feel guilt, okay? So let's move forward here. Let's see what's going on in Aries love life. What's going on in Aries love life here for the next three days? What needs to be said or rectified here? Source. For my Aries, for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, and South. No. What's going on with Aries and their love life source? What do they need to know? Definitely, my loves, if the reading is resonating with your spirit again, don't forget to like. Subscribe, my loves, if you're new here. This is what we do on a daily basis. We love and we simply evolve, okay? And definitely, again, hit that notification bell so that way you can be aware and ready for your reading comes out the next three days. I'm so excited to see definitely where the energies progress here for you, okay? And definitely, my loves, hit the notification bell to select all, all right? Because I do go live most nights. Not all nights, but I do go live most nights. And if you do have any other questions or concerns, all right, you can purchase a spread for only $15.55, just like I'm doing here today for you doing your reading. All right, it'll be the same format, the same way. All right, and also if you just have a question, you can ask a question for only $5.55, okay? And come hang out with us. We pull tarot cards, we laugh, and we have some fun, okay? So let's see here. Let's see what your love life is looking like, Aries. Let's see what's going on here for you, my loves. Source angels, what do we have for Aries? What do we have for the God and goddesses, for the divine masculine, divine feminine? What's going on in your love life, Source? What needs to be said here today? Source angels, ancestors, what do we have for my sexy ass fire signs? Ooh, thank you, spirit. Wow, we have healing family issues. Yes, so this is what this is all about, Aries, okay? This is in regards to your family members, your loved ones, people, places, and motherfucking situations, right? So let's get into it, all right? And again, if this is not your shoe size, okay, this is a, a shoe size of someone else. All right, this is a shoe size of your person for some of you all as well. They could also be feeling or having a situation here in regards to their family members and their loved ones, and they're simply not agreeing with your person or your family, Aries, is not agreeing with you. It's somewhere definitely between these lines or those lines. There, There's a family issue here that has transpired, I feel, for quite some time now between you and your loved ones. Oh, Aries, okay, and there's a situation here that, you know, you may have sat with it for so long and you've been trying to figure it out yourself, all right, and this is the cause or the delay as well for some of you all, because when we go through family issues and we haven't resolved them and they keep coming up in our memory bank and our consciousness, thank you, spirit, and, and it hasn't been dealt with or you haven't allowed yourself to release the feeling, the thought in regards to how you view it, right? Which is okay because it's always going to be there for you to go back to. And that's what retrograde season is all about. So you can go back to it now and reflect on it. That's what we're experiencing now as a collective in our consciousness. We're all reviewing and reflecting on people, places, and situations and how we played a part in them. And that's what that is to help us to move forward and be a better version of ourselves. So once you heal through these family issues here, Aries, then you will be able to call in your soulmate. Your soulmate is waiting and they're ready, but this is a part, as we call, like a bump in a row, right? So there is some family issues here with some loved ones. It could be your sister, your brother, your father, your mother, your auntie, your uncle, all right, your friends, friendships, okay? However, there's a situation here that is needing to be rectified, okay? All right, and we love you, okay? This is what we do over here, okay? But there is also a time that we have to love ourselves as well. So make sure that you're doing that, okay? So that way you can call in your true soulmate here, all right? Yes, because we have at the bottom of the deck, express your love, all right? Express the way you feel to your family members. Express the way you feel to your lover, to your partner. For some of y'all, this is an issue in regards to because how you felt in regards to the person that you were in a relationship before, okay? You have to release any guilt, 
All right, you have to put that pride to the side or vice versa. Your person is needing to put their pride to the side, their guilt that they have towards you or this relationship or their family members to the side for any of this to even work between you or your person, okay? So that way you two can move forward and truly, genuinely love each other for who you are authentically and not someone that's pretending to be someone else so let's put our pride to the side let's put any guilt that we have towards each other let's put that to the side okay so that way we can get an understanding i'm going to pull a card here from the kipper deck and then i'm going to pull out the model which is tarot deck to get further details and clarifications to see what needs to be rectified so we can move forward and call in our soulmate okay because i feel the energy okay i feel the love here that's wanting to be given okay and i would hate for you to miss out on that opportunity or even your person if this is not you aries okay so let's pull out the kipper deck let's get one card here to see in regards to the family paradigm here to see what's going here to be rectified for you thank you source wow yes we have imprisonment okay some of you are literally in a physical realm has been prisonated or someone in your family may has went to jail or your person for some of you all may have been to jail or went to jail here or has been imprisoned here or if not physically aries for some of you all this is mentally Okay, mentally, meaning in your mind, you have been trapped or felt imprisoned because of the thoughts and the guilt and feeling guilty of a situation trapped you and you felt guilty in your mind and you felt imprisoned in your mind because of this situation and what has transpired, okay? All right, just allow yourself to forgive yourself if this is you feeling guilty, if this is you, Aries, that has done this to your person or you cross watchers that's listening in, okay? This is very important so this doesn't block your love life, all right? So that way you can receive everything that you're deserving of, I say, all right? Wow, beautiful. So let's now finish up here. Let's pull out the tarot card here to get further details in regards to this situation. Wow, wow, wow. I'm so stunned and speechless in regards to your reading here. Definitely click on that notification bell so that way you're notified the next three days. I am so excited to see where the reading progresses here within the next three days, okay? Definitely take time out for yourself all right aries make sure to take time to think get in a quiet place and think to yourself recognize your awareness and where you're at and what has transpired between you yourself and this relationship or issue here so you can call in true love okay because it's definitely on the way for you aries okay we just have to rectify what's going on in front of us all right yes thank you source it's everything that i'm channeling out here for you it's time to go within Aries, okay, and your person as well, or this family member. So you can rectify this issue, whatever this is that's been holding on. Some of y'all, this could have been for years, decades, where you haven't spoke to this person, okay? And if you're clicking on this video, it's no coincidence. This is for you to hear this right now. It's time to get in that hermit mode, get into that Virgo energy. For some of y'all, this person may be a Virgo, okay? But however, it's time to go within, do some soul searching, some healing here. And some of you all that's already on this path, kudos and congratulations to you. Because you're getting ready to go through a breakthrough. You're getting ready to evolve like I myself. And if you're needing the spiritual guidance, okay, definitely click on that join membership tab, all right? You will definitely get that here on this channel, okay? So definitely, my loves, let's see what else comes out here for you. Wow, beautiful reading here. It's definitely speaking a lot of volumes. Let's clarify the hermit card for Aries here. Clarify the hermit card. Wow, yes. Everything I'm speaking here is the truth. Source is just saying, just confirmating for me, or excuse me, compromising. Some of y'all are needing to compromise as well. But I want to say confirmation. I'm getting a lot of downloads for you when that happens, Aries. But however, you're going to be getting the truth in regards to this situation as well. I feel like once you two and your partner or your family member as well, once you sit down and allow yourself to understand what has transpired you know time brings about a change time brings about a healing okay and some of y'all have healed from this situation as well and now your person is reflecting and going through the same process as well and this is a truth that you're going to be hearing as well you're going to begin some type of communication here when the ace of swords come out in regards to this situation all right and some of y'all this person may have air placements in their chart they may be a aquarius a gemini here 
or a Libra, okay, Aries? But this is definitely significant, and they're going to want to talk to you and explain to you what has been going on in their mind and why they have been feeling trapped, okay? And for some of y'all, you may hear from this person if this is someone who you communicate with that's in jail here or that you have, you know, communicate with, wrote letters to in regards if this is even a family member or your lover that's been imprisonated here or in prison, okay? You're going to be getting some messages of some truth here in regards or some clarity here in regards to this person or for some of you all this family member here okay wow let's see let's get one more card here what can aries take away from this reading here today source wow what can aries take away from this reading in regards to this person in this situation whoa thank you spirit let's see what we have for you here wow okay now this came out in reverse okay so we have the moon card here all right, this is Pisces energy here as well. Some of y'all, this person may have water placements in their chart. All right, but this is referencing to secrets, things that are being hidden behind scenes and have transpired in your life or it was going behind scenes in your person's life. But however, this card is out here in reverse. You guys seen it just as well as I did where it flew out here over the table. But however, this is a situation where the f the, for me, Aries, when this is in reverse, the secret is out. All right, there's no longer anything being hidden here. So this is some type of information, some news for some of you all as well, Aries, that you're going to be getting in reference into this person in this situation here, okay? Some some light is going to be shed on this situation. Rather, this is a person that is being imprisoned and some information comes out, a secret comes out here in regards to a situation here for some of you all, all right? And then we have the magician, we have the Magician card here coming out in reverse as well. All right, this is a situation for some of y'all. It may have blocked you again from manifesting or for calling in your soulmate due to some family issue here. You all may have had some family issues with this person here or in regards to your relationship with this person. There could have been family members that have caused you to or caused your person to block them from manifesting you or manifesting this relationship because when the Magician is in Reverse, this could also mean there was a family issue where someone was doing some manipulating, okay? Doing something behind your back and but trying to manipulate you. And some of y'all have found out, okay, the secret here. And you've gotten the truth in regards to this person and this person and why they have been put in jail for some of you all. This is a family issue here as well that some of y'all definitely comment down below and let me know how this is resonating for you because I'm getting a lot of downloads for you. Some of y'all, this is in regards to a family member. They may have done something and caused your person or cause the situation here where this person had went to jail and some of you all just on a mental state this has been hunting you and been in your mind because this person has felt so guilty and they have done things to hurt or harm their relationship and they have been definitely manipulating you and the magician here being in the upright being gaslighting you that could have been all type of stuff going on and i feel like now the secret has gotten out you have gotten some type of clarity in regards to a situation here in regards to a family member a particular family member spirit is saying for some of you all and others you in regards to your person here in this situation all right wow or someone finding out something about you aries just take it wherever it fit you know your suit your shoe size you know your shoe size and if it fit or not okay and if it don't fit then woo it's not you aries okay so wow this has been a beautiful reading definitely hit that like button so your fellow signs okay whether if you have this in your sun moon rising or venus or even a north or south no let your fellow air signs all right i wanted to say air signs wow i wanted to say aries what's going on some of y'all this person may have highly air placements in your chart or their chart all right or you may have highly air placements as well as aquarius gemini or libra here okay i know this is hitting home for somebody Oh my goodness, this is a lot of downloads, okay? I would definitely not, cannot wait. I am definitely going to note this reading here, okay? So definitely hit that notification bell so that way you can be notified the next three days here to see where this energy has progressed here. I'm definitely ready to tap back into this energy and see what's going on here. Definitely, if you are as well, you can definitely join me. I do go live again most nights, not all nights. And if you have questions in regards to this spread, you can ask for only $5.55 
or if you would like a more personal spread to get more clarity as well for you you can purchase the same type of spread here for only $15.55. Click on this video there so you can see how everything works there and get ready to select that drawing membership tab so we can evolve together, my loves. I love you so much, Aries. Remember, your health is your wealth. I'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye.